Karl Rove and his secret cabal of one percenters and their secret money are once again running another deceptive ad that attacks President Obama. Typical Washington. Obama says spend more and promises jobs. Obama donors and insiders line up for handouts. Obama gives his supporters at Solyndra a $535 million loan, even though its business plan is risky. Solyndra goes bankrupt. The FBI is investigating, and who pays the bill? We do. No jobs, just more red ink. The true engine of economic growth will always be companies like Solyndra. Mr. President, we need jobs, not more Washington insider deals. Carl Rove and Crossroads GPS uses wordplay in the ad to spread fear and misinformation, a strategic move on their part to elicit a certain response. For example, they say Washington instead of government. Typical Washington. The video starts out by stating, Obama says spend more, which is false. President Obama has called on spending cuts, and his American Recovery Act was the biggest tax cut in history. Note that Crossroads GPS uses the word spend instead of invest in another deliberate and strategic move. Next, the ad says Obama promises jobs, implying he is not succeeding. But in fact, a report by the Labor Department reported the jobless rate fell to 8.5%, its lowest rate in nearly three years. Obama created over 200,000 jobs in December of 2011. The ad goes on to attack Washington insiders, and Karl Rove himself is one of the top Washington insiders. The ad tries to appear like a TV news crime report, and they put a police siren in the background. The FBI is investigating and... Rove attacks Department of Energy Investments, but leaves out the fact that this Department of Energy loan program was started in 2005 by his hand-picked president, George W. Bush. Carl Rove should know that all business ventures carry a risk, and the $500 million Solyndra loan only represents 3% of the $15 billion in funding the DOE is investing in emerging solar energy technology. China is investing much more in their solar power industries than the U.S. Does Carl Rove want us to get behind? Crossroads GPS also leaves out the fact that Ronald Reagan invested nearly $1.7 billion in the Clinch River nuclear reactor, only to see it never built. That would be $3.9 billion in today's dollars. Crossroads GPS leaves out the fact that the solar power industry is one of the fastest growing industries, employs hundreds of thousands of workers, and gives us a promising future for sustainability. Once again, Carl, you've been exposed as a lying mudslinger, so stop running deceptive ads on behalf of your 1% corporate buddies.